Indoor ditto. Wow. Okay, this will be interesting. Now, we haven't, to my knowledge, we haven't seen any of G Slim's Ganondorf today, and obviously we've seen quite a bit of Lindy's Ganondorf. Very, very solid on the character so far today. Now we just gotta see who is more experienced. And it is showing right now as he gets off to an early percentage lead. But will Islam's not able to capitalize him off stage? Lands the forward air there. Litany very close to getting the KO here. Just needs one more solid hit, Ooh. and there it is. Steals it out with the Nair. Now, what is G Slim going to do here? Because he's looking to be a little bit outclassed so far in this Ganon Ditto. He may see a different style. I can already see. I Litany. would not be surprised to see him pull out a different character after this. Well, we'll see but how he it goes. does land that forward air. He is bringing this back. He hasn't taken too much damage on the second stock. He lands Ooh. a forward smash on the regular getup. It's practically even again. You never know with Ganondorf. He could be way behind and just two hits already be back up. And just like that, G Slim is up to 60, 70, 80% now. He is in KO range. He could very easily fall prey to a stray smash attack. Good shield there by Litany. So make sure that he doesn't die off of that smash attack. Gets the grab, forward throw. Going for the spike. Oh, oh. oh. And he lands the stage spike there with the neutral, or the up B. Oh. G Slim. Starting to turn this around, takes a lead in this game. We're gonna see if he can close it out here on the last stock though in this Ganondorf ditto. For those of you who haven't been watching earlier, G Slim is not normally a Ganon player. So far today we've seen him play a lot of Ness, but this is the first we're seeing of his Ganon. It is not looking too bad. Litany has played Ganon throughout the tournament from uh, what I've seen and has managed to make it here to our losers finals and G Slim is going even with him right now. Actually ahead right now. Litany in KO percent right now. One good hit from G Slim will end this game. But at the Ooh. same time, one good hit from Litany, oh. and there it is. Litany seals out the game with that back air. I gotta say, G Slim's Ganon is nothing to shirk. Very <laughs> impressive. Like, very impressive considering how much we've seen of Litany's Ganondorf. We know Litany is a very strong Ganondorf. And for a good portion of that game, G Slim kept that very close. Surprising. I, I feel like there's a different play style there, but I'm not haven't seen enough of game Ganondorf. Okay, we're seeing the Ness and Ganondorf matchup now. As expected, the Ness does come out. Yep. We'll have to see how Litany deals with this. Much like Meta Knight, Ness is a very small character, which makes it a lot harder for him to land those short hop back airs. But he's got a lot of harass, but unlike Meta Knight, he's actually got enough KO damage to finish him off. Very good point. Oh, but he lands the forward smash, and you can't kill him if you're already dead. <laughs> that could not be more true. Oh, look at these combos from Ooh. Litany. A solid 82% off of that one string. <laughs> but he's bringing in the harass, trying to get that evened out. It'll be interesting to see how G Slim is able to. Good tech from Ooh. G Slim there. It's the only reason he's still alive. But he air dodges right into the forward smash. G Slim really having a tough time in this matchup. I wonder if we're going to see the Ganon come back out. Oh, I feel like Ganon kicked it in overdrive for that one. Like... I, I, I think we might see the Ganon come out again from G Slim. That Ness was a little uninspired, <laughs> having trouble there with the Ganon matchup. Like you'd think in theory he'd be good, but he's got such a weak, I don't know. He looks small, so I feel like it'd be easier to knock out, but I don't know if that's actually the case. Uh, I mean, yeah, he would, he would be easier to knock out, um, but he's also faster, so it's harder to hit him, hypothetically. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Lydney going for the read there, hoping for the roll in. 
Avoiding this. Lands a stomp. Misses the up smash though, gets the jab. Warlock kick not gonna connect. Can he get the stomp though? Oh, Ooh. ledge trump into back air. We haven't seen that from Litany on stream today. Very good tech, very strong. Able to get Ness who has a recovery that's not always one you want to challenge. If you don't, if you get there too late, you're pretty much dead, especially as Ganon who doesn't have the greatest recovery. But here's where we've seen G Slim do really well. He does a, oh. Wow. Just misses it there. G Slim on tournament stock here. If he loses his stock, he'll be out of the tournament. Uh, whereas Litney's still with three stocks. Got a lot of room to work with. Doesn't seem to be faltering in his technique right now. Good back air. But all he needs is one good hit. I don't... Oh! oh. And he seals it with the Gan inside. <laughs> That's a safe bet. <laughs> Suicide for the win.